Good morning, yarn tubers. Welcome back to Dana's Wanderlust Crochet with Dana and Dooley. Now I'm gonna, you're hanging again from my upper bunk. Um, this is an update, uh, but first you gotta see my very messy bed and um, <laughs> my frying pan uh, set up here. I'm sure you'd like to, some of you have asked about this kind of stuff. Uh, the reason I'm in Layton, Utah is because um, Wyoming's closed. <laughs> They're closed for business. Yeah, Wyoming's in a bad way right now, so we're shut down. But uh, I'm going to take you down from your perch here Whoa! and show you my very messy unmade bed. See, I usually have to make the bed twice because... <laughs> I make it with the dog in it, and then later on, I can make it with the dog out of it. Yeah, he's waiting for me to finish cooking um, breakfast. I've got this, um, I bought this off of uh, Amway, this Nesco. It's an 8-inch electric skillet, and I, um, I bought this outlet strip, and I Velcroed it to the top of my refrigerator, and the cord goes down and goes into um, a pretty heavy duty extension cord that goes to my inverter. And then I keep, I just kind of protect the top of the fridge with these cheap uh, cutting boards. So anyway, I, I'm gonna try not to make you dizzy. I gotta hang you again. See if I can get you back up here. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I did not make it to Evanston. I decided if I was gonna shut down because when I shut down in Evanston, it's at the port of entry. So, you know, here at least I could Uber over to, um, boy, you're crooked. Um, <laughs> I could Uber over to Walmart, which isn't very far away, and get stocked up in case, you know, I do get stuck somewhere for a couple of days in Wyoming. <laughs> kind of emergency food and supplies, you know, so that's, I'm, I'm camping. <laughs> Maybe that's why I like this so much, because I don't know. I just love living where I work. I, I love, you know, having a job that um, engulfs my life, you know, that I can get so um, emotionally invested in. So anyway, I'm getting ready to cook some bacon. And I wanted to show you guys, I, you know, we talked about that thermal stitch pot holder and the oven mitt. Now the oven mitt I haven't tried yet, but you know, I've made hundreds and hundreds of these um, thermal stitch pot holders. And you know, I haven't gotten very far on it, but see, you know, the loop is incorporated into the chain and it is so thick. I mean, I can pick up, you make this the right size, the heat will never come through. So I have started this tutorial. Um, I hope that um, the, the gal that I learned it from doesn't mind. I have tried to email her, um, but I will link her in that tutorial. Um, assignment number two, crochet assignment number two, half double crochet in the round. I, you know, as some of you already know, I went to proof watch the final video on that and I was missing all of round three. So I was able to video all of round three last night, <laughs> uploaded it to Dropbox with the other video and I sent D the link. And, um, <laughs> cause I looked at my, um, my cheap little free editing, well, it's, I paid for mine, but it, it was a cheap little editing program that I've got on my phone and my tablet. And I can't really figure out how to open up the middle of that video and stick in round three. But D knows how to do that. D is over at, uh, Yarn Dragons Creations. So, thank you, Dee. And then I can get started on assignment number three. And, um, you know, I might have time today to uh, 
finish that tutorial. That would be cool to get up today. Um, I need some bacon and eggs here. Okay, it's bacon time, Dealey. Oh, he's starting to he's starting to come alive now because he knows there's bacon involved. I usually take <coughs> excuse me one of these big things of thick bacon and I cut it. I cut the bacon pieces into three, and then I take and I put these in plastic bags and I freeze it in my freezer. Do you guys want to see my fridge? Oh, my truck is so filthy right now. That's something I might do today is, um, is clean <laughs> this floor. I need to clean the floors. I need to vacuum and mop. But let's see if you can see this. Okay, there's the top. There's my, there's a calendar. <laughs> there's, there's my nephews. Oh, <laughs> Levi, your face is covered up, dude. Okay, there we go. And there's Cole. He's got California. Levi's got Virginia. Okay, and then down here, see, this is my freezer. And I've got stuff in there. And then this is the bottom part with my brother and sister-in-law and the boys and all my magnets. And here's my very messy refrigerator <laughs> yay so anyway some of you have kind of asked about that that stuff and I'm always embarrassed because when I think about doing it my truck is dirty like it is right now so so anyway cooking breakfast I wanted to go live but in order to do that on my phone it's very dark and I don't I'm not close enough to the building to get the uh internet connections so yeah if I use my phone it's very dark it is dark it is so dark and you know we did that a couple of times it wasn't good I might keep messing with it and see if I can get it to work and and we'll do a live while I'm cooking breakfast we'll see how that goes so um oh we're up to seven minutes <laughs> I squirrel so anyway, stealing my Darth Vader t-shirt pajamas and, you know, I've still got stuff not on the bed. What I do is, you know, I do have enough stuff in here that I have to shuffle it. When I get parked at night, I take stuff and I put it on the front seats, like my project bags, all my project bags. And um, then I try to make the bed with the CP head in it and get everything back over there and then pretty soon he's ready for his breakfast. Oh, I should feed him, huh? Um, <laughs> my dog wants his breakfast! He's so demanding! <laughs> so anyway, I wanted to tell you guys about that uh, pot holder um, that the assignments are gonna get uploaded <clears throat> I'll probably, um, you know, the yarn I want is at home for assignment number three, but I'm going to do a scarf, no fringe, it's going to be a double crochet, um, rows lengthwise, tire status change to and cold weather, my tire status, blah, blah, blah. Uh, anyway, yeah, um, no fringe, but I will have you putting a border on it. So... That's it. Breakfast, dog food, and he'll let me know when it's time to take me for a walk. So, anyway, love you guys. Bye.